My name is Dr. Sally Reynolds. I am a senior lecturer in hominin paleoecology here at Bournemouth University. And the piece of research that we're doing at the moment uh, is about hominins, which are human ancestors who lived in Africa, uh, in this case, a million years ago, and how they were using a site called Alorgasari in southern Kenya to conduct ambush hunting. Now, what's very interesting about this work is that typically archaeologists and people who are studying the past are focused on a particular stone tool, something that they find in the fossil record. Here we're studying a pattern of landscape use and in order to do that we had to reconstruct the ancient topography, specifically reconstruct the contours of the volcano which existed at the site to see uh, where were the steep roots that the large-bodied animals couldn't follow combined with soil edaphic analysis, which is where we were looking at where the, the areas of good grazing were that the animals would be searching for. And when we reconstructed the areas of good grazing, uh, the contours associated with the ancient topography and the feature, the large water body that was there, we were able to reconstruct the limited number of routes that the animals could have followed through the site and we were able to show that the location of the Alorgasili stone tool scatters are perfectly located to conduct ambush hunting. So if we look at the types of animals that were being hunted uh, strategically, these were not small, um, easy to kill animals. These were fearsome, aggressive animals. From my perspective, that tells us that the hominins were organized they were able to communicate a plan to each other. Um, this is not a, it's a sort of animals that you could hunt alone. And thirdly, there must have been another facet of the, of the kill that we're not presently understanding. And that is why we're hoping to go out to Kenya and do further research on the bones uh, of the baboons that were killed in order to understand exactly how they were killed. Was it blunt force trauma or was it something else? But it certainly shows that a million years ago, our ancestors were clever enough to uh, coordinate a fairly sophisticated uh, ambush hunt. And